One of Door County's most famous rooftops is getting a makeover. It is the grassy roof on a restaurant in Sister Bay. The grass is decades old, needs replacing. Fox 11's Laura Smith checked out the progress on the project today and has the story. Oh, we're putting uh, about six inches of soil on here and um, laying the sod. The grass roof at Al Johnson's Swedish restaurant is 40 years old and it's lasted us that long and we're putting a new roof up. Is under construction. 2,000 rolls of sod are going up there. In place of the goats that usually graze atop the Sister Bay eatery are landscapers working section by section to make the roof green again. We're just rolling the sod out like we're doing a flat lawn and stuff. We're just working on an angle. The old roof had been installed in 1973 and after nearly four decades had sprung a few leaks. Restaurant co-owner Rolf Johnson says it took a while to find a roofing company that could replicate the old roof's look but make what's underneath the grass even better. It's a new product. Uh, it's uh, polyester, some uh, recycled soda bottles basically and it's uh, designed to be a water retention mat so hopefully we don't have to water as much. Johnson says the new roof also has soil retention bars which will keep the sod from sliding off. He saw that happen with the first roof when his father watered it too soon. He told him not to but uh, the grass was starting to turn brown so he watered and everything kind of turned to a mud bath and started sliding down. As the project continues the goats remain grounded at a nearby family farm and they'll actually have to wait a bit after the roof is done to enjoy their new digs. The soil's going to be soft, the ground's going to be soft, even though it's been compacted, but uh, we need a chance for the grass to adhere to each other. Johnson expects the roof work to be complete by the middle of next week and would like to have the goats up by Memorial Day weekend. Hopefully it lasts another 40 plus years. In Sister Bay, Laura Smith, Fox 11 News. Restaurant managers go on to say, don't let the construction get your goat. The restaurant is still open.